So now let's see how we can work around with polygon to curve conversion inside of Blender. So here you can see that I have an object and let's say I want to take uh, the object's edges and then convert it into curves. So to do that, I'm just going to go around, press tab so that I'm in my editing mode right here. I'm going to press A so everything is selected. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete out only the faces. And to do that, I'm going to press X on my keyboard. And then over here, you can see that I can delete only faces. And once I do that, what happens is that the edges remains, only the faces gets deleted. So now I can select all. I'm just going to press A right here. I'm going to right click. And over here, you can see that I can subdivide this. So let me make it smooth by subdividing it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, let's say, increase the number of cuts and make it smooth right here, just like this. So you can go around and work around with us however you like, but you got a bunch of edges, as you can see. So now let's convert this into curve so that we can apply curve properties over here. So to do that, I'm going to go out, press tab on my keyboard, and then this is what you have. So now I'm going to go around into add. I'm going to go around into uh, not add, but in object, and I'm going to go to convert to, and then I'm going to click on curve. So once I do that, what happens is that curve is applied and then I can go around over here onto the object data properties. And as with any other curve, I can go around and then uh, increase out the details. So I'm going to go around over here onto, uh, let's say, for example, on the uh, brown right here. Let me increase the depth. And as with curve, you can see that I can increase this around. So I can increase around the depth, the resolution right here, just like this, as I was working around with curve. And you can see that I have um, just made a unique shape right here. And that is how you can work around with polygon to curve conversion inside of Blender. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.